The third option is for using Singularity. So let's click on the plus button on option three to expand the procedures. Singularity can use the Docker images directly and convert them into Singularity images. To do this, we pull the WPS WARF Docker image from the DT Center Docker Hub repository, and then the Singularity pull command converts it for use as a Singularity image. So let's copy and paste these commands and get this started. As this is working, we'll go back to our note here. We provide a singularity specific tag for the WPS wharf container because it removes some of the permissions features that are not necessary for singularity, but are necessary for Docker. And they can potentially cause problems for, for multi-node applications with singularity. So this is why we see the specific for singularity version tag for the WPS wharf image that's available on Docker Hub. Singularity stores its images in a file with a .sif extension. So when the Singularity pull command is complete, we can do an ls in this directory and see the SIF files that are available for use with Singularity. We'll pause while this process completes. The Singularity pull command is now complete, so we can list the contents or do an ls command on this directory and see that we now have a SIF file for the WPS WARF image. And this can be used in the singularity commands for the rest of the case studies in this tutorial.